Hello and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at the different stresses acting on an aircraft's structure. When an aircraft is in flight, it is subject to different structural loads. The structural components of the aircraft such as the wing, fuselage and the tail section have to be designed to withstand all the stresses that are acting on it. It is important to know the stresses experienced by an aircraft to understand how the structural components are designed and the type of materials that are used. So now let's look at a few major stresses acting on an aircraft. Tension. This is the stress experienced by an object when forces are acting in opposite directions. An example of this on an aircraft would be the thrust force which is acting forward and the drag force which is acting backward. Compression. This is the stress experienced by an object when the forces are acting towards it. The best example for the stress on an aircraft would be on the landing gear during landing where it experiences a compressive load. Torsion. This is a stress which can cause an object to twist. In an aircraft, the rotation of the shafts inside the engine creates a torsional stress on the engine and the wings. Shear. This stress is created because of forces acting in opposite directions at different levels or layers. The skin of an aircraft is held together with the help of rivets. Because of pressure differences or other aerodynamic loads, shear stress is experienced at these sections. Bending. This stress is a combination of compressive and tensile forces. The best example for bending stress is the wing, which experiences this stress due to sudden gusts of wind or turbulence and can also be seen during flight. If the wing bends upward, the upper surface experiences compressive stress and the lower surface experiences tensile stress. At any given point of time, each structural member of the aircraft will experience a combination of these stresses due to external or internal loads. The resistance to these loads and the stresses that are created is called as strength of the structure. To determine the stresses that are acting on an aircraft, a stress analysis has to be done for all the components of the aircraft. Some structural components are subject to severe loads such as the wings, the flap fairings, flight control surfaces, landing gear, etc. These components have to withstand the external loads acting on it, so the strength has to be increased and at the same time all the components have to be streamlined to reduce the drag. So that's all for my video on a few major stresses acting on an aircraft. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, do subscribe and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.